uh, on which we stand and acknowledge that it was never ceded. But I want to reassure the traditional owners of the land that this convoy, at its heart, is about reconnection with country. It is about reconnection with the land, with the water, with the great artesian basin, with the great barrier reef and with the future of the nation. That is what this convoy is all about. As I was coming here this morning, it reminded me very much of how it felt at Greeny Acres nearly 40 years ago. Down there, people came, rallied for a river, for a wild river. They came from all over the country, young and old, in peaceful determination to save that river and stand up to the politics of destruction. And now, from Tasmania, we are returning the favour. Young and old, we are leaving here to take on and go right up the east coast of Australia, all the way to Queensland and then back to Canberra. This is historic. This is a momentous occasion and it's rare when you're actually living it that you recognise that's what it is. As Theresa said, it is bad enough that Notre Dame has burned in the last day or so. But it was accidental. The difference we have here is we have a Morrison government deliberately burning the Great Barrier Reef in the name of jobs and growth. We have an opposition. We have an opposition which equivocates. And we've got a Green Party that stands up and says no more coal. The age of coal, oil and gas is over and that's what this convoy says as well. Enough. Enough. We're up and going. We're happy about it. We're coming to get this whole country to vote. Stop it, Arnie.